everyone! A few weeks ago, I made a video talking about my Star Stable horse wishlist. The horses that I need to buy on Star Stable. Need to buy. <laughs> well, I thought that, you know, it would be super fun for me to allow a wheel spin to actually control my wishlist. There are a few horses on my wishlist which I'm not entirely sure whether I want. Like, they're kind of like on the fence. So... This could, like, help me with those specific horses, but there's also some horses, <clears throat> Picasso, that I really, really, really want to buy. So if the wheelspin removes those ones, then it's a bit of a sad day for me. Obviously, like, my wish list isn't binding. It's not going to stop me from buying the horses. But if I ever do videos where it's, like, wheelspin decides what wish list horse I buy or buying a horse for my wish list, anything like that, then this is my, like, official wish list. I don't know how entertaining this will be for you guys but this is a silly idea but let's just get into it. The first horse on my wish list is this bay paint horse I suppose you could call it. I'm literally so bad at coat names. Let's just get into it. Let's tap spin. Okay so we have two options on the wheel. We have stays and a little heart. Oh no. And then goodbye with a silly face and a waving and guess what we just got you guys. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm actually so sad right now because obviously this horse is on my wish list. Not to fear though because we have a second paint horse. If you guys don't know me, I love my paint horses. So like any paint horse that gets removed from my wish list, I'm going to feel a little bit sad over. All right, this black American paint horse, three, two, one, click. Let's see. Are you kidding me? There's no way. <gasps> The wheel has definitely just gone, girl, you own every single other American paint horse. You can just take a chill pill. And to that, I tell you, Mr. Wheel, I do not agree. I do not agree. I can have all the paint horses that I want. Well, we have one more horse. I think I said this last time. We have one more American paint horse. This is slightly less like an American paint. Like it is a paint horse, but it's a little bit of a, like a very subtle paint horse. It is the chestnut one on the Star Super Horses app. All right. Chestnut paint horse. Let's see what happens. Please, you've got to at least let one of the paint horses. I would say what are the chances, but it is a 50 50 chance. Oh my gosh, this is not off to a good start. The wheel spin is like you have got too many horses on your wish list. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and calculate after this how much all of the horses on my wish list cost together. And I'll have the star coins on the screen right now. Let's see how many star coins all of my horses cost at the end of this and see, you know. It's just making my life a bit cheaper, I suppose. The wheel, the wheel really said no to the pain horses. I feel like I should have put more choices on the wheel so there's like four yeses, four noes, so that it's a little bit more evenly spread than just half the wheel and half the wheel. Oh well, it's too late now. The next horses on my wish list are the Pentavians that I don't own. I'm going a little bit crazy because I've got like every single Pentavian on my wish list. So let's get started with this Palomino one. Wheel, you gotta say yes to at least some horses today. Oh, I think it's gonna stay! <gasps> the Palomino Pentavian is the first one to stay on the wish list. Yeah, <laughs> let's go. Finally. I think that this Pentavian right here is definitely one that I I really want this one to stay on my wish list. But let's see what the wheel thinks. No! No, please keep spinning. Just keep spinning. And the wheel said goodbye. <laughs> This Pentapian here is actually not on my wish list because, I mean, I had the American Pain Horse on my wish list, but I can't change my wish list now. So our second last Pentapian is the gray one. Let's see. How many Pentapians is the wheel going to allow us? Okay, let's see. And the gray Pentapian stays! Alright, so our very last Pentapian is the one on the app. I think it's like a buckskin or something. So let's see, are we allowed to, you know, maybe two Pentavians is enough for the wheel. Let's see. I feel like I'm just gonna, this, this video is gonna be kind of repetitive. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, the wheel loves to say goodbye. The wheel is being ruthless today. Am I not allowed to be happy? <gasps> no, like all of my horses. 
Our next breed of horse are the Belgian Warmbloods. So uh, the very first one we have on my list is the Grey Belgian Warmblood. I actually own this horse on my old account, but I'm a little bit crazy and I want to own it on my main account. If you want to hear more of the backstory between, behind all of these horses and how much it actually physically hurts me <laughs> to not have some of these horses, then you can go ahead and watch that horse wishlist video because I kind of go more into depth how much I really want the horses and like backstories between why I want them, which might be interesting to some of you guys. So this horse, I like on the fence about. I do not mind if the wheel says no, but now I kind of mind if it says yes, because wow, you're going to let me buy a repeat horse, but you're not going to let me buy another American Pain horse. I take that personally. So let's spin for the gray Belgian warm blood. Let's see. The ads on this website I was not prepared for is kind of annoying. No, oh, wait. Yay. I mean, I don't know how to feel about this. <laughs> Apparently it's a goodbye to the Grey Belgian Warm Blood. The next one on our list is the Palomino. And honestly, I really liked this one when I saw it in the wishlist video and I still kind of like it. But this one, I once again do not mind. I'm not overly a Palomino lover. I know, I know. So at least I'll feel a little bit less heartbreak if this horse is off the list. Let's find out. Palomino Belgian Warm Blood. Let's see what happens. It's looking like a goodbye. It's looking like a silly, goofy goodbye. Thanks, Wheel. I really appreciate you. Well, the last Belgian warm blood is the Pinto Belgian warm blood, and I, this one, I do not even want to spin the wheel for this one because it has, it said no to like 80% of my horses right now. So let's just get it over with. Let's just get it over with. Please, please, please let me keep spinning just a little bit more. Yes! Yes! Ah! And the Pinto Belgian Wolf that stays! Oh, you don't know how much ha that makes me so happy, you guys. Where are the Connemaras kept? Is it Dundle? I think it might be Dundle. We have one Connemara on the list, and it is the Silver Bay, Silver Dapple. It is this one right here. Because the Connemaras were like the very first Generation 3 horse to come out, they don't look quite as generation three as our 2023 horses, but there's something about silver dapples that I really, really love. So once again, I'm not gonna be, we've got more silver dapples on the list, so I'm not gonna be too heartbroken right now. Let's find out. Ooh. Oh, it looks like it might be a close one. Oh no, I think it's gonna stay. And the Connemara stays. We just got two stays in a row. I feel like that's unheard of on our wheel spin right now. Either way, the next horse on the list is on the Star Stable Horses app. And it is the Silver Bay, the Silver Black. I don't know what it's called. Silver Dapple. The Yorvik Pony. This horse had very much sentiment. Like, I'm actually going to be sad. I meant to buy this horse all the way back in 2021. And I never ended up doing it. If you want to know the backstory as to why this horse is more special to me, then once again, you can watch the video. But yeah, I'm... I'm gonna be a little bit sad if this if if the wheel still says no to this horse. So let's find out. But it also feels like very rare today that the wheel to say yes three times in a row. And it looks like it's gonna be another few years before I can buy this Yorvik pony. I think this might be the last Yorvik pony that I don't own as well. So it's a little sad because I can't complete my collection. be real let's go say cheese did you not save my be real what the heck bro i have one icelandic on my wish list i've had this horse on my wish list since the day it came out that can't be said for every single one of these horses but this one when did they even come out i don't know it's been like a year or something please don't disappoint me will i'm hoping for a stay i'm, I'm really hoping for a stay for this one let's see let's find out i think it is Yes! It's a solid stay. Oh my gosh. I feel like it's going to be so much more interesting if I divided up the wheel differently. But either way, this horse has stayed on the wish list. For a comparison, we have currently gone through 13 horses. And only 5 of them are staying on my wish list. So... It's definitely making this cheaper for me to save up for my horses, right? <laughs> Ooh. This horse is on my wish list. We'll get to that Mustang soon. Our next horses are the Morgan horses. And conveniently, this one right here is on my wish list. I want to call this one like, I want to call it like either like a silver chestnut or it might be like a flaxen chestnut. But whenever I see a flaxen chestnut, I feel like the mane is more of an orangey color. Whereas this was like a gray, white, 
creamish color so i don't really know what to call this one let's go ahead and find out though this one also has a bit of sentimental value sentimental feelings to me i've already clicked the button so i really want yes 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 okay we have a sentimental horse on my list thank you will thank you <laughs> And we also have another Morgan. We have this one, Silver Dapple, here as well. For the same kind of reasons, I just love the dark. The dark body, the light man in tail. Is the wheel going to let us have two Morgans? I guess we're about to find out. Let's see, let's see. Oh, 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 it's a yes. We get to keep both the Morgans. Maybe that's because I only owe, like, two Morgans, I guess. Two is quite a lot, actually. I don't know. We have officially just had three yeses in a row, I think. I think things are looking up for us. And that is a good thing because the Tennessee walking horses are one of my favorite horses that I feel like no one ever rides. And this one here, this doesn't have sentimental value or anything like that. I purely just love this horse. I think it's called a Sooty Buckskin or something like that. There's a horse coat like it on Red Dead Redemption 2, and I believe they call it a, a Sooty Buckskin, so... They might be wrong, but at least we're wrong together. Let's find out. I just love this market and I do not- I think I own one- two Tennessee walking horses. <gasps> yes! Oh my gosh! The wheel! The wheel is spinning in our favor! <gasps> it's stay. <laughs> okay, I'm kind of scared now because the next few horses that I list are Mustangs. And... Oh, I didn't, I didn't write my, the Dartmoor ponies. Okay, we do also have the gray Dartmoor pony. That one's on my wish list. I actually had to watch my own video and write down my wish list because I've never written it down. I just use my YouTube videos as my wish list. That's where I keep my wish lists. So we got to do the Dartmoor ponies as well. Wait, is this where they are? Is this where the Mustangs are? No, the Mustangs are... I went to the wrong spot. I'm just going to mix it up then. <laughs> Oops. The next horse on my wish list is the Grey Dartmoor Pony. This horse I really, really want. If you watch my other Dartmoor Pony videos, then I really, really wanted to buy this horse. That has not changed. The Dartmoor Ponies are adorable. Ad adorable? Adorable. I love ponies. Let's see what the wheel thinks. We have just had four yeses in a row. So I'm sensing to no. <laughs> no. No. Technically, like... No. No. Not my double pony. Oh. Well, the next breed on our list is... Well, it's also here, so we might as well do it now. This horse here, this Passofito. It's a Passofito that I hate, but I also love. So, as much as I say that, though, I still lean towards the side that I really want it. Obviously, the Passofitos have been out for a while now. Probably, like, a year and a half or so. So, I've been waiting for this... Actually, this horse came out later. But I have still been waiting to buy some of these Passofito horses for a while. But I just feel like today is not my day. Let's see what the wheel thinks. I just feel like we had we had a good stretch there of yeses. Ooh, it might be close. It might be a little bit close. It might be a little bit close. <gasps> oh my gosh. It's like on the line, but it's ever so slightly on the stays. Oh my gosh, the Pacifino gets to stay. You know what? The Mustangs are my favorites. Well, not my favorites. I don't know why I said that. That's not what I meant. Like the Picasso one, the Picasso one is definitely on my wish list. So I feel like we should leave that one to the very end. So let's go to our second last horse breed, which is, drum roll please, <laughs> the field horses. I feel like the field horses are underrated, but maybe they're just old. I don't know. And I actually have every single field horse that I don't own on my wish list. I, li I like them that much. I actually only, I, I need two of them. <laughs> so let's spin for the first one. This brown. There's like two brown. There's like this brown and then there's like the redder brown. This one here is probably my favorite. So this one, I'm like, okay, I own like all the fjords. It's okay. So let's see what the wheel thinks. Let's see. If it chooses this one over the redder one, I'm going to actually be really sad. I'm really scared. Okay, this horse gets to stay. But this really scares me because it just means like... It doesn't mean this mathematically, but in my head it just means that I have less chance of getting the red, the redder brown. The redder brown? Who am I? I don't know who I am. So let's just say one last goodbye to this horse. I just feel like it's gonna be a goodbye. Okay. 
Oh my gosh, the wheel loves me. I think it's confirmed. Okay, maybe the wheel was a little bit salty because I was like known for wheel spins maybe. I don't know. Back in 2020 when wheel spins were popular. But then wheel spins got a little bit less popular. So I don't know how popular this video is going to be. So maybe the wheel was a little bit salty at me for that. But wheel, don't blame me. I just give the viewers what they want and they didn't want the wheel spins anymore. I love wheel spins. It's not my fault. We are onto the Mustang horses. I've got four Mustangs on my wish list. I would say I only have one that's really on my wish list. The first one we have is this Leopard Appaloosa, I want to call it. Um, this one I really want, but it's I don't really like it, but I really want it. I don't hate it as much as the Paso Fino, but I want the Paso Fino more than I want this one. I know, it's so confusing. It's so complicated for why, I don't know. Let's just go ahead and spin for our first Mustang Wards. Oh my gosh, don't, don't give me that face with your two colored ears. Oh, it's almost on the line again. It's on the, it's on, but it, it's, it's right in stays. Okay. See, once again, this doesn't mean anything mathematically, but I just feel like my chances for Picasso are going down, down one at a time. Like the wheel has to say no to one of these Mustangs, right? We're gonna skip over Picasso for now, and we're gonna go straight to the Red Roan. This one I was torn at buying between this one and this one for my very first Mustang, so I still really want this one. But if it means that my Picasso chances are higher, I'll take it. Okay, let's let's just go ahead and spin. <sighs> this like literally gets me so worried. Okay, it stays as well. The wheel has really favored the last few horses on our list. That literally means nothing. But <laughs> the next horse we have is the Palomino one. I don't know if this is a Palomino one because I feel like there's less differentiation between the body and the mane and tail. So maybe it's more of just like a cream or something. I don't really know. Let's just go ahead and spin. This one I don't usually like, but I really like the coloring of it. Oh no, this one stays as well. Okay. Okay. I just, it said yes to every single mustang three out of four and now we have the horse that i want so badly the picasso look at this paint pattern you guys it's so cool and i just feel like it's gonna say no because it said yes to everything else it's been saying yes to everything it's it's due to say no i don't even want to find out let's just press it okay i pressed it oh my gosh Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! The wheel really loves me! Oh my gosh, yes! <laughs> because there stays on the wish list. I'm acting like this is telling me I can buy it right now, but I still can't buy it. Like, that's the thing with this video. It's like, I mean, sure, they're still in your wish list, but you still can't buy them just yet. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy right now, you guys. I could cry. If I've done my maths correctly or counted correctly, I had 24 horses on my wish list at the beginning of this video. And I am actually left with 15 horses on my wish list. At the start of this video, we had, you know, didn't it, wasn't it like five to like 15 or something? Like the wheel was saying no, 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 no. But it had a change of heart by the end of this video. And I get to buy Picasso. Pica well, not yet. But Picasso is still on the wish list, you guys. Speaking of deleted, this isn't super similar, but I recently made a Red Dead Redemption 2 video. It's completely family friendly about the beautiful horses. But Red Dead Redemption 2 actually deleted some of the horses before they released the game. And if you don't know, Red Dead has beautiful horses. And some beautiful horses were deleted. So if you want to find out about some horses that didn't make the cup we can play with through mods and everything, you can watch the video on the screen right now. I, I've been really enjoying playing Red Dead lately. So there's probably going to be more content on horses and stuff for Red Dead in the next coming weeks. I love you all so much. And let me know whether I should make a video where I actually buy some of my horses from my wish list. I love you all so much and I'll see you all later. Bye.